Welcome back to episode two of our Blender Journal. In the last episode we left off, we just made part of the blades for the helicopter. And I may have adjusted something so I could get a better snapshot. But anything I adjusted was just overlays and stuff. The helicopter blades will still be the same. Um. Hmm. Okay, so this episode, I think I'm just going to try to tackle how to get the body to look right. Um, hmm. Let's just move. Oh, wait. I need the middle bit. So let's just move this out of the way. And then... Hmm. I think we just need this view because we're just gonna worry about shape for right now. <sighs> Let me pull up a reference quick because they have just Google search helicopter image and image search that. Okay. Um, hmm. We'll not worry about scaling it too much until we actually attach it to the helicopter blade, which is probably a mistake. But let's at least scale it up a bit. And then I think what we'll do is go into edit mode. Um, would this look good if I just kind of extrude it a little bit? And then this is where it's going to be really scuffed and we may not even keep any of this. If we inset the faces, oh, that is not exactly what I wanted. But we can, okay. And then, extrude, hmm, no. If we grab it, no. Uh, face select, hmm. Let's go back before we insert it. Okay, I do that to place. There we go. I think because I tried to extrude it and then I just right clicked it, it still separated the vertices. Oh gosh. Okay, so let's just try to grab it along the x-axis for now. Grab along the z-axis. And then, how do we do a loop cut again? It's control R. I don't know if I want to loop cut it though. I think I do. Okay, so hear me out. If we add a loop cut down the middle, okay right click to just make it perfectly in the middle and then we select this face face please and inset it hmm I don't think that's not going how I want either Hold on. 
Um, because what I'm wanting to do is I want to try to get the tail by. Let's try doing another loop cut. Okay, do two there. Because this is, I feel like we're going to have windows similar to this. And, okay. Yeah, I'm just kind of doing stuff till it sticks. Is that too much? I think that's too much. Okay, so let's just try this. Uh, face select. Is there a shortcut for B? So I go I, and then I go B. Okay. So if I go to this thing and then hit B. Okay. No, that's not exactly what I was wanting, but it's a more of a box select it looks like. Hey, what, look, what does it look like if I extrude this bit? And then let's say we grab this one edge and pull it upward. And then maybe, um, does it work if we grab the face and then try to scale it down? Thing it looks better if we do it that way. Uh, let's see. And then. Oh, I'm in the edit mode still. Duh. So if we do this. Are we able to. Copy paste this? Hold on. Let me make sure time hasn't gotten away from me. Oh, it has a little bit. Okay. Um. Hmm. For right now, what we'll do um Hmm. I think we have enough time to like add a material maybe and then Call it there, I guess. So we want to add a new material, call it um, the body, and then uh, what color do I even want it? I, my brain automatically goes to green because that's the classic army copter kind of look and it also might be because I've been playing balloons uh, maybe darken it a bit uh, play with the what's the metallic on this I, I did it metallic and it, so a little bit of metallic or a lot of metallic and a little bit more roughness And then let's uh, try it. There we go. So it's just a little bit askew. Um, I think that's good progress. I, this is, you know, this. 
isn't going to look like a helicopter. <laughs> but, uh, I'd say as long as we get something that resembles a helicopter and we learn along the way, um, that'll be mission accomplished. Uh, I still didn't set up a camera, so I'm just going to have to... Uh, what, what is it? Render just the viewport, yeah. Oops, I left the uh, user thing up there. But you'll probably not see it, because I'll probably, like, black it out. But I usually do this in full full screen mode, but I forgot this time. Oh, well. Um, thanks for watching. This turned out better than I actually expected it would. I, I don't know. I didn't have much of a plan going into it, uh, at all for how I would make the body look. So, I think we'll just end up adding more touches to it and maybe, I still feel like we might end up just restarting the whole thing at some point. But this isn't going to be a perfect helicopter. It's just going to be us learning the ropes. So, um, still don't know how to do outros. So, thanks for stopping by. Uh, goodbye.